It's halftime versus Sanford, and honestly, I'm not that upset with what I saw in this first half. There were a few plays where, or a few drives where I was not thrilled. Obviously, that first drive, um, I know there's probably a lot of people who are upset we didn't score. We got down to the one, uh, turned the ball over, didn't score any points. I'm not mad at that drive. The reason I'm not mad at that first drive is that, um, honestly, I think we got some good practice trying to go for it, trying to go for the end zone, practicing those fades, some stuff that's going to help us later on. I know some people are going to be mad we didn't just punch it in. I'm not mad about it. So so I'm not going to fall in the same camp as the people who are upset about that first drive. I'm okay with what happened. Um, honestly, overall, I'm just happy we're passing the ball more. We've made some very good deep passes with Peyton Thorne. Um, we, we've had some good catches from, I think, Rivaldo Fairweather, Jay Fair. I think Shane Hooks either had, I think he had one as well, or he almost had a, another touchdown. Um, but honestly, what I'm seeing in the passing game is not that bad. It's pretty good. Is the score what I hoped it would be at halftime? Um, uh, it's about what I hoped it would be. Uh, I thought we would win by about four, 30 to 40 points. We're on track to meet that. And so I'm not terribly disappointed with what I've seen so, so far. Uh, the, could the running game be better? Yes, but I think the most important thing for this game is that we focus on the passing. So the passing has improved overall from what I've seen in previous games. Yes, it's Sanford, but the passing is looking better. So I feel like we're figuring some things out. We're figuring things out as a team, and I'm hoping to see some more of that as we continue this game versus Sanford. Uh, here's what I'm hoping we can do in the third quarter. I'm hoping with Peyton Thorne, we can get like 20 points, uh, maybe a little ambitious, 14 to 20 points in this third quarter. Uh, get some quick points right away because we should start with the ball. And then I'd like to see Robbie Ashford or Holden Garner come in and get some meaningful snaps. So I want us to get far enough ahead that Coach Hugh Freeze feels comfortable with uh, changing the quarterback, and we can get some meaningful snaps with another quarterback. Um, honestly, at this point, I feel like we're starting to click, so I think this is completely possible. It's just going to depend on how we come out uh, in that third quarter at the very start. We do start with the ball. Um, I, I really, out of the running back so far, the running back I really want to see more of. I'm honestly in the camp right now. I want to see less of Jarquez Hunter, which uh, may surprise some people because I've been a big Jarquez Hunter fan. I want to see more Jeremiah Cobb, more than anybody. I think he has the potential to be our best running back, and it's not even close. And uh, everything we've seen from him, he just seems like he is ready to explode, ready to be that explosive running back. And um, I think he just needs the ball more. So I'm hoping we can see more from him in this second half. Uh, our receiving game, I've, I've been pretty, fairly impressed with for the most part. We've made some errors, we've had some good catches. We've been, uh, you know, the main thing is that I think we're doing better. We're doing better, we're passing more, we're getting the reps in, and I think that's only gonna continue in this second half. And yes, I'm still aware we're playing Sanford, but the, the thing is, we've gotta get in a rhythm We've got to figure out who we are offensively because when we play Texas A&M in College Station, we have to know who we are. And right now, from what I'm seeing at halftime, I think we're headed in a good direction. So uh, that's kind of my take on what I saw uh, so far with the offense. Uh, defensively, I think we're doing pretty well. We're being pretty consistent. Uh, there's been you know, some disappointments, but for the most part, it's, uh, it's as expected. So defense, I'm pretty happy with as well. But uh, going into this second half, I want to see the passing game continue to develop. I want to see more of Jeremiah Cobb in the running game. And I think those things, if we can get uh, some confidence built with Peyton Thorne, that's only going to pay dividends when we go to College Station and play Texas A&M. Those are my thoughts. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. Like this video, share this video, subscribe to the channel, and I will see you in the next one.